How should I talk? Should I not talk? I mean, you want to say something? Say something, say nothing. <laughs> Life of a designer is a life of fight. Fight against the ugliness. Just like a doctor fights against disease. For us, a visual disease is what we have around, and what we try to do is to cure it somehow, you know, with design. Good typographer always had sensitivity about the distance between letters. We think typography is black and white. Typography is really white, you know, it's not even black. It is the space between the blacks that really makes it. In a sense, it's like music. It's not the notes, it's the space you put between the notes that makes the music. For instance, we designed the corporate identity for American Airlines. This is done in 1966, and the novelty at the time was the fact of making one word instead of two American Airlines by making American Airlines or one word, half red and half blue, just separated by the color. And what could be more American than red and blue? You know, so it's perfect. It's the only airline in the last 40 years that has not changed their identity. All the airlines come and go and they change it. American Airlines still the same, and there's no need to change. And how they can improve? They got the best already, you know. <laughs> American Airlines in Helvetica. We always had the tendency to use very few typefaces. It's not that we don't believe in type. We believe that there are not that many good typefaces, you know. Uh, if, you want, if I want to be really generous, it's a dozen. Basically, I use no more than three. There are people that think that the type should be expressive, uh, that they have a different point of view from mine. I don't think type should be expressive at all. I mean, I can write the word dog with any typeface and it doesn't have to look like a dog, you know. Uh, but there are people that when they write dog, it should bark, you know. What is very thing? It's a typeface that was generated by a desire of having a better legibility. It is a modern type. It is a very clear type. It's good for everything, pretty much. You can say I love you in Helvetica, and you can say it with Helvetica extra light if you want to be really fancy, or you can say it with the extra bold if it's really intensive and passionate, you know, and it might work. You can also say I hate you, you know, I can write, you know, uh, I certainly can write a few letters in Helvetica and saying that, you know, <laughs> to Washington in particular, <laughs> if I can put it that way. When Helvetica came about, we were all ready for it. It just had all the right connotation that we were looking for, for anything that had to spell out loud and clear, modern. 